Effective police work requires constant training, and that does not just apply to humans. As News 13's Rex Hodge reports, one Mountain Police Department has a brand new training center for four-legged officers. Ask anyone in law enforcement, and they'll tell you their four-legged companions are their full partners, and in many ways can do more than they can. I mean, they can smell out. Uh, just about anything. Ryan Smith is a senior deputy with the Haywood County Sheriff's Office. His partner is Reno, getting some training and tracking in the Crabtree community, learning how to sniff out things like drugs. Somebody's got something hidden in the car anywhere, you know, where I can't see and I can't smell. He can pick it up. All right, buddy, you ready to go track? Smith is just one of many officer canine teams from across North Carolina learning how to team up and fight crime. It tests the dog's agility. Sergeant Brandon Gilmore says many of these teams now have access to a new permanent canine facility just opened by the Waynesville Police Department. The land's been donated by nearby junkyard owner Scotty Schulhofer. The space dotted with broad jumps, hurdles, and A-frame. Even, ironically, a catwalk. The dog has to climb up the top, uh, maintain a stationary position until recall to a heel position. Gilmore says up until now, all these pieces of equipment had to be moved around to different locations for training. Having a permanent spot to certify dogs, both locally and regionally, he says, is vital to maintaining a dog's proficiency and a relief to their human counterparts. Right, we don't have to move it, and we done moved it once this time, and I'm glad not to have to move it again. All thanks to a businessman's donation of land. A nice <laughs> gift for us, absolutely. In Haywood County, Rex Hodge, News 13. And the facility is available to all law enforcement in Haywood County and surrounding jurisdictions, including Buncombe and Asheville.